Welcome to my channel. Uh, today I'm going to be talking to Officer Serda from Maryland. How you doing, Officer Serda? I'm good. How about you, man? I'm pretty good, pretty good. Chilling, chilling. So, uh, just tell us a little bit about yourself. I was born in Virginia and then moved to Maryland. Got one son. Um, I love to dance, mostly Spanish music. I'm into like merengue, bachata, salsa, and all the other stuff. Um, my favorite hobby is wrestling. Awesome, man, awesome. So, I'm going to be asking 10 questions. It's everything is about law enforcement. Um, before we work on the questions, can you tell us a little bit about your experience in law enforcement? I've been in law enforcement for like two years now. Um, I'm taking this slow by slow, no rush to for any uh, any promotion. I like to do what we do, do community policing. Awesome, that's that's the best part of our job, man. So, the first question is, what made you choose a career in law enforcement? I always wanted to be a, a police officer since I was a kid. And always try to do the best thing to help people out, even though you can't really help everybody out. But at least that I can do at least try them. That's what I like to do, make an effort. That's right, man. That's right. Uh, the second question is, what is the most original excuse you were given to get away from a traffic citation? Oh, I didn't. Um, I was late for work. I didn't see the light. You know. And the funniest part, though, my favorite was I have to use the bathroom. That's why I would need to pull over to the gas station. <laughs> I hear that. I, I got those two. All right. The third question is, what's the, the funniest thing that has happened to you in your entire professional experience? Uh, I'm going to make this brief. Uh, I had a situation with a guy. I stopped him because of thought he was probably possible intoxicated and driving and then when it turns out uh, he was not feeling good all of a sudden he kept calling me poppy hey poppy uh i need to go get something poppy this and i'm like with all the respect sir i'm not your poppy <laughs> we got that a lot bro we got that a lot all right number four what is the most difficult situation you have found yourself in throughout your career? Well, dealing with teenagers is the thing that a lot of people don't really like dealing with teenagers because, you know, teenagers are just out of control. So I always try to do the best way handling in a way that, you know, we could both compromise without, you know, calling the parents. I got you, bro. Number six. What comes to your mind when you have to take the gun out of the holster? Safety. Make sure everybody's safe. Make sure the civilian's safe. Make sure my partner's safe. Always make sure we watch their six, no matter what. Yeah, you got that right, man. This is number seven. Do you regret being in a law enforcement officer? Absolutely not. I enjoy being a law enforcement officer because I know every day I put that uniform and I know I'm doing something good. Yeah, I feel you. Number eight, what motivates you to continue as a law enforcement officer? Day by day, I take it little by little and I always make sure that, you know, with the support with my family, that I wake up and do something good and make sure I come home to my family safe and sound. At the end of the day, we make sure we go home safe. Yep. I feel you in that one too. Number nine. How do you want to be remembered if you die in the line of duty? But a good deeds that I do, you know, helping people out. You know, even though like I can't really give everything out, but at least I can do something good. Like, you know, if a homeless guy is hungry, I don't mind giving him, you know, getting some food for him because no, deep down inside everybody needs to eat. But at least I know one day he's like, hey, that officer actually helped me out when I had no money and he's got me some food for me. Yep. I think that's a that's one of the most important things in our career, man. Alright, number ten. The last one. What message do you want to give the community about law enforcement officers? Well, we're there to help and protect and serve. You know, we have to do what's right no matter what. Even though some people some people do not agree on or the officer agree on. 
but we always make sure we do the right thing and go everything by the book. Yeah, thank you, man. I, I really appreciate your time, Officer Serda, and you know, just stay safe. Always watch your six, and you know, whatever you need, I'm here, brother. And thank you for everyone to watch. Just remember, we're gonna have more interviews in our channel. And you know, if you want to see those interviews, just subscribe to my channel and hit the button notification and you're gonna receive notification every time we, we upload the video, okay? Uh, share this channel and see you next time, my people. Take care.